Ashraf Kuku does his final touches on this painting. He's among the competitors at a United Nations sponsored campaign here at Juba University in South Sudan. His portrait depicts a woman surrounded by doves, some patching on her head. Concerning the, the piece, I first uh, thought about peace, what peace, and, and where, where does it start from? Uh, and as it is very clear here that peace uh, is, uh, is, is a total tranquility. It's a total tranquility within someone's uh, self, and uh, uh, it, if it is not within you, then you cannot go with it anywhere, or you cannot give it to it anywhere. So, uh, for me, if I am to give a name for this piece, I can call it peace of mind, because peace must first begin, or must get initiated within you. Then after you, it can go to other, uh, to other people, it can go to your friends, it can go to your community, to your family, and it can expand, it can go uh, to all the nation. His message of peace is what this exhibition and competition is all about. The United Nations mission in South Sudan has been running a year-long peace campaign, which eventually culminated in an art competition. It is dubbed Peace Begins With Me, marking the 75 years of UN peacekeeping. We believe strongly in the power of art to achieve good and to do good. We believe fervently that art can play an important role in building a peaceful, prosperous, and protected South Sudan. Art is a powerful medium for communicating our vision of the future of South Sudan. At ANMIS, we believe that the peace we desire must first begin within us, within every single one of us. In fact, I don't believe you can give to somebody something you don't have. South Sudan has experienced political and ethnic turmoil, escalating to civil wars since it seceded from Sudan in 2011. Most of these students were children or teenagers by the time South Sudan acquired independence from Sudan. The art project is seen as a way of getting them to express their thoughts and campaign for peace. This event is like a chance to introduce my student to, to, to see how they can exchange knowledge, how they can tell their own story through painting, through drawing how they can think before drawing, think of how to be more useful in community, think how to use the tools that they've been here training to get, okay? To be like a tool that can be used to make change in real life. And that cannot happen unless they fill themselves with these needs and then try to transform it through the media that they have been training to do. The best students were awarded with certificates. It is hoped that their message on display would go beyond the art exhibition to help the South Sudanese people get the peace and tranquility they deserve. Wanjamungai, CGTN.